and we're back so what we got to do now is talk to Bandelaire and see if he'll let us see the Lord we are in Corthelius northwest side we got to eventually make it to this dungeon up here stone Vargo so ye of little faith sir Brother seems ill inclined to help you. Your timing could not have been worse, Traveler. Lord Dremont's attentions are focused slowly on the stone vagal at present. In any case, it is not my responsibility to escort visitors. Take your letters and show them to Sir Alvois. Yes, Sir Alvois can surely accommodate you. Seek her in the storeroom on the opposite side of the yard. Alright, so he's passing us off to somebody else. Now, if we do go in this dungeon, I'll probably level up my rogue and then bring my rogue in because I don't want to take it, tank it first time. Ooh. It's all this. What you doing here? What you are? I'm part of the expedition to snow cloak and there I'm bound in short order my task was to replenish the supplies in the camp food has grown almost as scarce as warm well that sucks what about you a hammers a dangerous thing in the hand gone numb the smith of winter has my fingers in her vice I have a need of an occasional thaw by the fire or I'm liable to send that hammer flying into a kinky noggin or a nightly noggin okay well sorry to hear about Charles coldness but I'm looking for owl boys I don't see him over here I don't see him over here Is he not in this room? Let's zoom in a little bit. Hmm. Is this like a hospital or something? Maybe he's on the other side. Like down here. Oh, there's a bottom level. Okay. And there he is. We're in the cellar. Let's take a quick look around, make sure we're not going to get ambushed. Good. Alright, out boys. Sir Brenner Blade, you speak with me. Did he? I know why not he presumed I would be in a better position to help, but I assure you that he is mistaken. Lord Dermont hasn't the time to spend speaking with low-ranking knights such as I. However, he always has a moment to spare for head churcheron astilian why not visit the infirmary upstairs and show your letters to him all right so back upstairs we go do i have any mail nope no mail so this is the infirmary then okay And she said he's upstairs. I wonder it's so cold in here. All right, Azure Dean. Are you here to visit a patient, sir? What's this? Letters of introduction from the house for amps and Hedernate? With documents such as these, you need not seek an escort. Pray proceed to the barracks and speak with Sir Gulenex. He should know Lord Drummond's current whereabouts. Alright, I feel like I'm dealing with the government. All this running around place to pace. Nobody knows anything. Looks like I'm at DMV. You need this paper. You bring this paper. Oh no, you need this paper as well. So you leave, come back the next day with another paper. Oh, you didn't need that paper. You just needed this paper. That's what I feel like. All right, so we're on the barracks. 
Let's head upstairs. Let's just come up all through their barracks. Go straight to the horse's mouth. There you go. There's the lead man I need to talk to. Gudernox. What reason have you for barging into... Oh, I see. Well, you are in luck. Lord Jermont is just up these stairs. Letters are no, though. I would not expect much. How Sternjan, as a whole, does not hold adventurers in high regard. You had best state your intentions quickly and succulently. Show proper respect, and it shall be returned in kind. Uh-oh. Going to the head man himself. Oh, he's got a whole party of people up here. We'll be back for you, head honcho. We're going up to your bedroom, to the top of the tower. I just wonder how they get these stairs to stay like this. What's in here? Ooh, more stairs. I'm going up. This is like the bell tower or the watch tower. It's the bell tower. Um, I probably can't get back in from here. Oh, we can. Awesome. And back down we go. Let's talk to the head honcho. Sir Gukernox permitted your passage. Very well, speak. Here's your letters. You wish to brave a ruined outpost filled with scale kin to secure an airship that may or may not be there. Are you the avatar of the fury herself? I am. Oh, these guys are back. We are the signs of the seventh dawn, Lord Drummount. You know our name and you know our deeds. We are come to Cothrilis to slay Gruda, Lady of the Vortex. To that end, we seek the Enterprise, the airship of Master Sid Nan Garlord, who stands before you now. Master Garlord, you're alive, but that's impossible. Indeed it is, my lord. Do not be deceived by their honyard words. These foreigners are not to be trusted. At this critical moment in Ishigard history, as House Drenadar marshals its forces to retake the stone Vago, who should appear in Whiteborn Front but three mysterious strangers? Sig Garlon, missing and presumed dead since before the Calamity, and two scions of the Seventh Dawn. A defunct band of misfits re recently exterminated by the Empire. The lesser houses may have been duped by these grandiosos lies, but I should hope that the house Strindar would have greater sense. I know not why these three seek the stone Vigo, but I know that we cannot permit them to pass. Oh, he's a traitor. Thank you for your counsel, Inquisitor. For a moment, I never really leave this mumbler's farce. You three will not enter the outpost until we have reclaimed it, and until you declare your true intentions as well. It could be moons before House Jack purges the dungeons from the stone Rigo. We cannot afford to wait that long. Sid, Tickman, we must do whatever it takes to earn Lord Drummond's trust. Understood? Ye of little faith is complete. So I'm guessing we're going to have to do like 50 quests for him. To prove where we stand. But as it looks, we have a whole bunch of quests to do around town. 
So that's how we're going to prove our faith. We're going to help people around his city and get his faith back. But that's for another day. So until then, y'all take care. My name's Tick.